94.3 The Point. It's the Jersey Shores Hit Music Channel. Hello there. It is 8.54. It is Lou and Liz, and we are so happy to have in our studio co-CEOs Hackensack Meridian Health, Robert Garrett and John Lloyd. Great to see you guys. Good morning, Lou and Sue. Yeah. Well, Sue? We love, well, whatever. Sue, <laughs> Liz, it doesn't I started matter. With, I was, I'm sorry, Liz. I'm, I apologize. No, it's okay. Lou gets a kick out of that anyway. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be talking about that for a uh, yeah, yeah, they'll bring that up all show tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, congratulations on your top ranking in U.S. News and World Report. So you, give Liz. us some details. Yeah, be glad to. Uh, we're, we're really thrilled about it. So um, this year we're, we're proud to announce that Hackensack Meridian Health has four hospitals within the top ten as ranked by U.S. News and World Report. So starting with Hackensack University Medical Center, number one in the state of New Jersey, six years in a row since U.S. News and World Report started the rankings. But this year, in addition to Hackensack, we have three other hospitals that made the top 10. So Jersey Shore University Medical Center, number four, and then Ocean Medical Center and Riverview Medical Center tied for number eight. And the, the recognition, the award is great, but it's really about the hard work and the great outcomes that are achieved at these hospitals each and every day. The doctors, the nurses, the entire healthcare team, they are the ones that really deserve the credit for these uh, great rankings. So uh, U.S. News and World Report, obviously a big deal. When people read about this, consumers read about it, are they taking it to heart? And, and what do these results tell the public about your hospitals that they might not already know? Well, there's no question that consumers today really do keep track of uh, health care in terms of, you know, which hospitals are offering the best programs. Um, also, through social media, we reach out to a lot of the consumers so absolutely everyone's focused on that, and we do very, very well in the rankings. And this genera- the generation of people today uh, very much are into social media. And what does it take to get these top rankings? I mean, obviously you recruit the top physicians, you have the best ner- nursing staff, you have the best equipment like MRIs and robotic surgery. So what else? What is it it's that really, gets you It's that really all of the above. It's really the, the entire team effort. So e- to recruit the top doctors, you really need to to have great quality care. And, and doctors, as, as well as consumers, look at U.S. News & World Report. They look at which hospitals really have the best quality care. Yeah, they do care. their homework. And they want to be part of that. You know, they want to be part of a winning team. Nursing, I mean, great. I mean, we've really valued nursing at Hackensack Meridian Health. We were the first hospital and the first health network to become uh, magnet certified. So that, that, what that represents to nurses is a place where nurses can practice their profession in a really positive way. It's known for nursing um, excellence. And then the technology plays a big part as well because U.S. News & World Report, what they look at is they want to rank and they want to recognize hospitals that have become very proficient in a particular specialty, in, a particular, in treating a particular disease. And you can only do that through, um, through numbers, meaning you do a lot of cases, and that you have state-of-the-art technology and that you have the best doctors, the best nurses, the health, best health care team. And a- another great recognition is the fact that Hackensack Meridian Health is also recognized nationally in certain specialties. And those specialties are oncology, neurology, and neurosurgery, orthopedics, urology, as well as open heart. And again, that is another measurement. And that's very important to the consumers. They go online all the time to see how well we rank. So we're just thrilled with the outcome. As Bob said, it's all about the nurses, doctors, and everyone else. And even beyond the the excellent rankings that you have, there's always something new going on at Hackensack Meridian Health. So, uh, John, give us an example of, of one of the projects that's going on. Well, one of the projects uh, that just completed was just completed was at Ocean Medical Center. They have a, a, a new 36-bed unit. And one of the things that's very interesting is that unit was designed with the consumer and the patient uh, um you know, being being the most important part of, of what's done on that floor. And uh, they have innovative technology. They've put together some, some absolutely uh, great technology, made it easy for the nurses and the consumers. So uh, we're very, very proud of that floor, and it's a new 36-bed unit. One we're talking— thing that, One other thing that's uh, happening up north at, at Hackensack, we're about to uh, break ground uh, for the uh, largest expansion project in the history of Hackensack University Medical Center, a new tower— that's going to include 150 private rooms, state-of-the-art 50-bed ICU, and 24 uh, new operating room suites. So really big uh, big project going on up and, north And as just well. as Bob is gearing up up at Hackensack, we're finishing a big project at Jersey Shore. Uh, that project is a 10-story building. It's called the Hope Tower. It's right on Route 33. 
and we're going to wow. complete that uh, in late March. So again, it's not so much about the buildings and the facilities. It's, it's what it represents to the consumers. We're going to be able to deliver better care, and we are always are looking for ways to be innovative and, and do things that are important to patient care. We're talking to uh, co-CEOs of Hackensack Meridian Health, Robert Garrett and John Lloyd. Guys, where do people get more information? Well, they can go on our, uh, our website at, um, at hackensackmeridianhealth.org. Thank you so much for all the info, and congratulations. Thank yeah. you very Thank much. You, Liz Thanks for Lou. having us. Great. We're lucky to Good live to here. We're right, right around three of those hospitals, yeah, so we're very go. happy. 94.3 The Point.